I invite all who are able to rise for this morning's unison prayer. Please join with me. Almighty God, we gather again to worship you, and we are grateful to do so. As we journey through this season of Lent, we think about our relationship with you. How closely are we willing to follow you? How far will we go? To the cross, we pray to be honest about our commitment to you as we acknowledge your unfailing commitment to us. Thoughtfully, we pray, amen. And let us sing together our opening hymn, Are Ye Able? come now to this time of prayer, we will begin with silent prayer. Let us pray.
God in death and in life. We gather in your presence again this day to worship you, to pray to you, to sit in silence before you, to sing our praise to you, and to celebrate the faithful connection we have with others because of you. All we do, we do to worship and praise you. And why not? Your glory is incomprehensible. Your blessings go beyond our naming. Your stunning creation is all around us and in us. With all of our senses, we have the ability to experience you. Of course we do, for we are yours, Lord, made in your image. We belong to you, and in that truth, we find great comfort. We offer you this day our continued commitment, our praise, and our appreciation. Now, Lord, we ask that you hear us as we join our voices, praying together the prayer we have been taught to pray, saying, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen.